Let's move on up to the nose. We're going to take these two splines and arc them out to give us a bulge for the nostrils. I'm having a little trouble seeing the splines, so I'll select this side of the skin and change the properties to see through. I can also change the selection filter to shapes, that way we won't accidentally select the surface. We need to make the ball of his nose here. I'll get rid of this segment and construct an opening. This time, I'll initially start with a new shape. These lines don't actually intersect, so we'll have to increase the tolerance of our cross insert. Now use Fuse to bring them together. You remember Chamfer from box modeling? Well, it works here too. Now delete those segments and add a spline around the opening. Select spline and copy it up into the nose. Now use cross section to connect it. The reason we have a hole is because there are five sides here. By the same token, the reason the opening is closed off is because we only have four. The way to fix this is to switch the two. We'll make sure that the opening has at least five sides and this one only has four. I'll start with the inside being all smooth. That's a problem for one of these vertices. Turn off your area select and pull one away. Now change it and snap it back.
we'll smooth the bottom out. and round out this ridge. We never welded these points, so I'll do it now. We could probably switch it to smooth. And that looks good. In the end, we'll increase the steps and it'll be even smoother.